usually won't find out through me telling them, but they will find out when they hear their name in one of my songs. And I just want to say he seems like one of the coolest people on earth. I don't know when I want to end up like settling down or something like that. I don't know any of those things, but I do know that like the idea of romance is kind of what what makes me get out of bed in the morning. Guess what's brewing in the Taylor Swift universe? Brace yourselves for a whirlwind of emotions because our favorite songstress has a surprise in store. Now, we all know Taylor Swift is the queen of heartfelt lyrics and swoon-worthy romance, but hold on tight because this time, it's not just a lyric from her latest hit, it's real-life magic. Travis, the ever-dashing charmer, has taken the leap and flown all the way to the land down under just to be with our girl Taylor because, well, he missed her. Can you believe it? I know, I know. Cue the collective awe from the fandom. So. Buckle up and get ready for the inside scoop on Taylor Swift's reaction to Travis making an epic journey across the globe just to catch some quality time with our favorite pop sensation, It's Like a Love Story. But this time, it's happening in real time. But before we get into it, make sure to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to never miss out on any new videos. It's free and helps us tremendously bring out new content for your enjoyment. So, get this. Taylor Swift hops on a plane and travels a whopping 6,000 miles from Tokyo to catch Travis Kelsey rocking it at the Super Bowl in Las Vegas. Now it's payback time. Travis, with the Vince Lombardi trophy securely in hand, again, no biggie, decides to return the favor by flying a cool 8,000 miles from Los Angeles to Sydney. Why? Well, to witness the queen herself, Taylor Swift doing her thing on stage in Australia, now that's relationship goals. With the trophy safely tucked away, Kelsey's got all the time and resources to be the ultimate Taylor Swift boyfriend, and rumor has it, he's acing the role right now. Now that's what I call a love story with some serious frequent flyer miles. TMZ spilled the tea, and it's hotter than ever. So on the night of February 20th, Kelsey pulled off a VIP move and boards a private red eye from LA straight to Hawaii but that's not the end of the adventure. The next morning, he jumps on another flight, this time destined for Australia. By the 22nd, Kelsey and Swift are on a dreamy date at the Sydney Zoo, complete with a VIP-style private tour. Turns out Swift loved the zoo so much the first time she visited that she just had to take her boyfriend for a round two. Now, fast forward less than a week from Super Bowl Sunday, and Swift is rocking Melbourne, Australia with a record-breaking crowd of 96,000 fans. She even declares it the biggest show ever, and trust me, that's saying something. Because let's face it, Taylor Swift season never really ends. It's a perpetual swoon fest. The burning question, will Travis Kelsey be spotted in the crowd at every show? Well, we can't predict the future, but the VIP section at the Eras Tour doesn't sound like a bad place to be, does it? And what we love the most is that Kelsey might have been living the Aussie dream with Taylor Swift in Sydney. But it seems duty calls, my friends. News just in, Kelsey has bid adieu to the land down under and his pop sensation girlfriend to jet back to Las Vegas. Why, you ask? Well, it's the classic back to partying with the Chiefs move. TMZ spilled the beans, claiming that our favorite tight end is taking the skies once more heading straight for Sin City to continue the Super Bowl celebration with his teammates. Kelsey, after landing in Sydney just this Wednesday to catch a glimpse of Taylor's Eras tour, is now set to touch down in Las Vegas on Saturday morning. That's a solid 15 hours of flying, not too different from Swift's own globe-trotting escapade from Japan to Nevada for the Super Bowl. The party continues, folks, and Kelsey is clearly clocking in those air miles like a true MVP. Stay tuned for more tales from the jet-setting life of Travis Kelsey. Guess what, party animals? The Chiefs' shindig in Las Vegas isn't just a spur-of-the-moment decision. Oh no, it's been in the works since they clinched that nail-biter against the San Francisco 49ers with a sweet 25-22 overtime victory. Yep, you heard it right. The reunion plans were apparently set in motion the moment the confetti settled on the Super Bowl field. It's like they had a crystal ball for seeing the need for a victory lap in Sin City. So, as Travis makes his way back to join the Chiefs' celebration, you can bet they've had this Vegas extravaganza circled on their calendars for quite some time. 
The Chiefs know how to party, and they're proving that their post-Super Bowl festivities are as meticulously planned as their winning plays. Keep those party hats on, folks. The Chiefs Vegas reunion is about to kick off, and it's going to be legendary. He is practically clocking in frequent flyer miles to Vegas, and it's not just a one-time thing. This marks his third visit to the City of Lights in just two weeks. Before jetting off to Australia for that epic meetup with Taylor Swift, Kelsey was in Vegas earlier in the week, teeing off on the golf course and kicking back with pals. And now, here's the scoop. A Las Vegas DJ spilled the beans on Instagram, revealing that the Chiefs had booked him for an event on Friday night. But alas, it seems Kelsey might be fashionably late to that party. The man's got his hands full, though, because let's not forget the heart-melting moment at Accor Stadium in Sydney. Kelsey was right in the midst of the Swifty madness, exchanging friendship bracelets and waving at the ecstatic fans. But what did the duo do while in Australia? Well, Swift and Travis Kelsey kicked off their Aussie adventure with a bang, and guess where? The zoo, of course. These two lovebirds made their way to the Sydney Zoo for an exclusive private tour, making all of us collectively wish we had a VIP pass to the kangaroo enclosure. Local media outlets gave the adorable details, Taylor and Travis weren't just spectators, they dove headfirst into the experience. Feeding kangaroos, striking the perfect selfie poses, and of course, the quintessential hand-holding stroll. Taylor kept it cool and casual in a red-striped tank top, denim shorts, and white sneakers, while Travis rocked a pair of patterned shorts, a black tee, and the timeless white baseball cap. It's basically the dreamy zoo date we never knew we needed. Kelsey took a detour to Buenos Aires during his globe-trotting adventures with Taylor Swift. And let me tell you, it was nothing short of adorable. The lovebirds enjoyed a cozy dinner date with none other than Taylor's dad, Scott Swift. Because family approval is key, right? Caught on camera and shared on TikTok, the A-list duo were seen strolling hand-in-hand -hand along a harborside wharf on a dreamy Friday night. Now here's where it got even more swoon-worthy. Speculation was rife that the couple might have hopped on a boat ride from Olympic Park to their hotel at Crown Sydney in Barangaroo. It was a romantic cruise overlooking the iconic Opera House and Harbour Bridge, and fans couldn't help but rave about it. Before the enchanting evening, Swift rolled up to the stadium in serious style, a convoy flaunting three Range Rovers and a Lamborghini. But let's not forget the adorable date at Sydney Zoo, where they scored a private tour and gave us all a glimpse into their love story. These two made Australia their own romantic playground, and we were there for every sweet moment. Now here's the sweet stuff at one of Taylor's shows in Buenos Aires. The duo shared a moment that made fans collectively swoon. Tyler, the lover singer herself, practically ran into Travis's arms for a sweet backstage kiss. Cue the heart-eyed emojis. But hold on, folks because as quickly as their Buenos Aires love fest began, it wrapped up in a flash. Kelsey was spotted hopping on a jet less than 24 hours after soaking up the magic of Taylor's performance. He was also super adorable supporting her. So what do you think? Comment down below and let us know. If you liked this video, click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to be the first to see my next video. I post updates like this every week where I uncover the secrets of your favorite celebrities.